بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم مائی نیم از احسان اینڈ ٹوڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو فکس ورڈ پریس لاگ ان پیج ریفریشنگ اینڈ ریڈریکٹنگ ایشو بفور اسٹارٹنگ ورک اٹس مائی ریکویسٹ پلیز سبسکرائب مائی چینل تھینک یو نو بیک ٹو آر ورک وین یو کلک آن لاگ ان پیج دین اٹ کیپ ریفریشنگ اینڈ ریڈریکٹنگ سیم پیج سو وی آر گوئنگ ٹو فکس دس سو کلک آن لاگ ان پیج ٹو چیک So now you see it show login page again. There are multiple way to fix this issue. So your issue will be fixed by any method. We will show you in this video. So first way is to clear browsing data. So go to menu and now here you see history and then clear browsing data. So click on it and then click on clear data. after clear browsing data your issue will be fixed if issue not fixed after clearing browsing data then we will proceed further so now go to second method go to hosting now and open website folder now here you see dot htaccess file so delete dot htaccess file so right click on it and click on delete confirm So file is deleted now. Now go to web page again. Enter login information again, and then click on login. Now you see login work, and we are on WordPress dashboard. Now on left side you see setting, and then you see perma links. So click on it, and then click on save changes again to create .dot htaccess file. Now setting save, and go to hosting again, and refresh the hosting. Refresh. Now here you see .dot htaccess file created. When we click on save changes, so this is second method to resolve this issue. Now, if your issue not fixed after deleting .dot htaccess file, now go to WP Content folder, and then here you see plugins. So plugin folder rename. So right click on it, and click on rename. so rename this folder and then click on confirm so item rename done so this is third way to resolve this issue now go to wordpress dashboard and if your issue not fixed after deleting dot htaccess file we rename plugin folder and if login work then this issue occur due to some plugin issue so go to plugins now you see plugins not show and now again go to hosting and then rename folder again to plugins and then click on confirm go to wordpress dashboard plugins and refresh the page now you see all plugin here and you can activate plugin one by one to identify issue which plugin caused this error and after deactivate all plugins if your issue not fixed then again go to hosting and then rename theme folders or you can open theme folder you can rename your current theme folder so our theme is awarda so right click on it and click on rename so you can rename your awarda folder after renaming your current theme folder your issue will be fixed so this is our fourth way so go to wordpress dashboard and go to themes appearance theme now you see your current theme is not active if login work then issue will be your theme so last way is to resolve this issue is go to hosting and open mysql open your database now we are in php my admin so this is our database open it and go to option table so this is our option table now you see site url and home and also you see option values so if these both value are not same then add same value here then your login refresh issue fix so there are five way to fix this issue first one is clearing browsing data history and now you see clear browsing data second way is to delete dot ht access file third way is to rename your plugin folder and fourth way is to rename your awarda theme or current theme folder and last way is to 
check site url and home value in your database to fix login issue i hope you like this video please like comment share subscribe thank you for watching